I have to try to put my hands on this again. Scared to buy any older forms. Red Scat Pack. 392 Shaker. This brand new 2023 Rapid Blue. C8 right here. Cat. I thought it was a Scat Pack. It's a hell cat. Top speed 101. What's going on, fam? It's your boy Al. Y'all tune back in with them Jennings boys, man. And we back with another video for y'all, man. Make sure y'all stop what y'all doing. Go hit that subscribe button. Hit that post notification bell. Like this video. We're gonna keep running these numbers on up, man. It's Monday, so y'all already know, man. We at Man High Monday. We looking for cars to whip. We looking for cars to flip. And we looking for cars to review, man. So I just pulled up to the Man High. As you can see, we in big dually truck. Starting to pack up in here. It's actually sale day today because yesterday was Labor Day, so wasn't no preview day. So we're about to get in here real quick, see what they got in here, and uh, see what we can try to buy, see what we can try to flip, and see what cars we can try to review. So, man, make sure y'all stay tuned. Make sure y'all go like this video. They got shit scattered out everywhere out here today, y'all. So I ain't seeing none of the cars where they supposed to be at. There with that truck. Is that my truck from last week? It must have been an if sale. Yeah, this is my truck from last week. But I got outbidded on. I must not have went for the money they wanted. Wonder why I didn't sell. Hell, y'all. Might have to try to put my hands on this again. Let's start right up. Start right up, y'all. Leather seats. We're gonna take this one down the truck again, y'all. Q7 right here, y'all. 2010, 130,000 miles. It yeah, is kind of look a little ran down. It's got leather though, got the roof in it. I'm scared to buy any older forms. See how it sounds. Don't sound too bad. Check engine light on. Tire sensor light on. Uh, screen don't work. Radio screen don't work. I'm telling how much that is to fix. It's kind of light in here today on the flip on the car flipping side. Just seen something with some wheels over here. This kid right here on these wheels. It's these Lexanis. <laughs> kind of feels as easy. These them Lexanis. 2018. 54,000 miles. Somebody put a steering wheel in this mug. Hell no, nah, I don't. Like, no, this ain't the factory steering wheel. This one of them special steering wheels. buttons on it. This might put some pipes on here. 
Somebody was driving this like it was a Hellcat. They got one of them Hellcat or Scat Pack steering wheel type steering wheels in here. This ain't even a stinger. This is a condenser. This red Scat Pack 392 Shaker. It's like that same one that's been here 23,000 miles. I mean, 22, 2023, 20, 20, 1,000 miles. It's like the same one that's been here for weeks. Must want too much money for it. It's the stick shift one. Yeah, it's the same one that's been here for weeks. It's gonna tell me it all right here. Porsche Panorama Turbo, that mug's still here, y'all. 2018, 68,000 miles. What else they got over here? This Bronco right here, clean. It's a big bin. Bronco, 2022, 11,000 miles. What else they got over here? They got this CTS over here. Got this orange F Sport. Auto will be all over this. It's a RC 350. Two seats. Got two seats in it. Got a roof in it. Got the roof in it. Leathered up. 71,000 miles. Lexus. Got this 600 Escalade. Let's see what interior this thing got in there. Got the black interior, the white stripes smell good in here. Still got that new car smell on it. Escalade. Let's see that. Big grill on the front. 2021, 49,000 miles. Yeah, 49,000 miles, 2021. They all come with the wood grain. I ain't seen one with the wood grain before. On the rest of them, somebody must have built this one because I ain't really never seen one. Usually got that grayish blackish color looking. They still got this four runner up here. Ain't nobody buying that either. This CT4V. 2020, 38,000, 34,000 miles. Let's hear how this sound. CT4V, got the V on the steering wheel. Still the start him up over here. Some kids back there, you can't ride four full adults comfortable in this car right here. But it's pretty clean though. I don't see no flaws with it. Let's see what it go for, y'all. Another Porsche Panorama over here, 2018. This one got the light peanut butter in it. C8 right here too. Panorama 4, 2018, 51,000 miles. We got this brand new 2023 Rapid Blue C8 right here too, 3,000 miles. It's got the black cloth interior, what the hell? How do you get a vet with no leather? Got a couple little leather pieces on here. That's it, that's weak. Smell good though, that new car smell. My car still smells like this too though. I like them floor mats. I ain't looking to me some weather mats, but it ain't the same when you got that all red effect going on. You need them all red mats. It's a coupe too. Coupe. Coupe. Got the skinny body Hellcat 2020. 2,000 miles. Cat. I thought it was a scat pack. It's a Hellcat. Two door. No roof in it. Let's hear how it sound.
let y'all know what this one go for, man. Alright, fam. I gotta cut this video short, man. We had to get up out of there. Auction was getting ready to start. They had a million and one things going on there. People walking around everywhere, man. They was washing the cars, moving the cars around. They had all the cars I wanted to test drive blocked in or either already on the lane for the for the sale. So, and like I said, the sale was getting ready to start. So, really wasn't a good day to get a video. That's why I like going on the day before the preview day so we could really preview the cars and test drive all the cars. I really didn't see much in there anyways. It was pretty light in there today on any cars that I would be interested in. So I went ahead and got up out of there so I can get back to the shop before a bunch of customers get to pulling up and stuff. So yeah, next week, hopefully next week will be a better video. Um, I wanna start buying more cars for y'all, man, to get y'all that, that full experience. But like I said, I'm only a one man army with the car lot. So you know what I'm saying? It's hard for me to do everything. It's just, just being a car, uh, on a car lot or being successful with the car lot, man. It takes a lot of time and effort, man. And it's hard to do when you don't got a team of people helping you out, helping you find the cars, buy the cars, salesperson selling the cars, you know, somebody to work on the cars, somebody to transport the cars. So, yeah, you already know I got a million and one things going back, going on up here at the shop, so getting ready to, like I said, head back up here to the shop and uh, sell some of these tires. I don't even got no cars on the lot right now. I need to post this Lexus, but uh, we gonna see. But uh, make sure y'all stop what y'all doing. Go hit that subscribe button. Hit that post notification bell. Like this video. We gonna keep running these numbers on up.